Could cost Olympic. This is not high tech world. You haven't got radios necessary to talk to people. Gardner sees the keeper off his line. What a great, fantastic goal. And Adam Gardner. Yeah, definitely agree with that. And I'll tell you what, he'll be in for a big second half, especially with the wind. It, uh, Western going into the wind, but. Um, you know, good here distance is, here. Yeah, here is Gardner and Corley standing over it. And it will be Gardner to take and Gardner to score. And it was tough to keep out. It was swerving and it dipped in. Rose. And here is Aiden Gardner looking for a second. Aiden Gardner, dead eye into the bottom corner. Isn't he playing some superb football at the moment? 4-1 to Edgeworth. We were having some discussion about earlier. Okay. Gardner. Goes forward, has a shot, it takes the deflection, it's a goal! What a strike by Gardner! It takes the deflection. Dylan Holtz. Back to McBreen, Edgeworth, owning the ball at the moment. Cross for Gardner, gets a header on it! Goal. And it's goal. in! Goal. Aiden Gardner has put Edgeworth into the lead. And in the 19th... Um, try to look for the through ball, is through. And it is it's a good ball from Holtz, and... Gardner, who scored in the first half of extra time, he can seal it here. It's he Gardner, has. and it's three. three Aiden Gardner has buried it, and the lightning fast move from Edgeworth. Goal of the campaign now for Kane Goodchild and a really valuable one because you'd have to think that makes the point safe, but no, there's a chance, and that's Aiden Gardner. Feet. Again, yeah, silky more. foot. Sorry, was more. Yeah. Good fast feet. Here it is. There it is. This time, Edgeworth goes 1 0 up. Green got some ex A League players out there. This time, Gardner finds Oliver Smith. We know he can score. Strikes and does go. Edgeworth Eagles 2, Maitland 1. Speaking of personalities, Brad Swancott celebrating his 40th birthday as we see McBreen back stick.
Definitely not the way you want to start when trailing to Twinsworth. Yeah, but I think second half, it's 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 not necessarily been so much uh, Valentine's failing second half. I think Edgeworth are really Chance just... here for Will Bowie. He's gone down in the penalty spot and he's yeah, gone. Yeah. I think he's given it. away from Nishiura oh. and now here is Will Power he is bearing down on goal it is a tough angle he cuts it back onto the right boot can he break the drought? to Bradbury it's been a good quality game CT hasn't it some excellent play at stages sometimes the ball's just evaded that final pass just evaded Will Bauer with a bit of space you've got Aiden Garner on the left hand side Wilson in cover Garner crosses it to Bauer, knocks it down. Oh, what a great finish. Just couldn't find a way through. And Wheeler will jab it forward for Gardner. And now they go long, and McBreen is away from Langlois. Could this be a second? Well, that would have been... Over lands back with it again. This time out for Gardner, who delivers. Good ball in. And this time for Abrizio, just outside the... Toad away. Yep. Deep breath as Aiden Gardner skips over the challenge of Michael Sessions. Has Ollie Smith in the middle. Good first touch from him. Gardner a neat one too with Apeta Sano who continues the run. He's got an engine, Aaron Apeta Sano, and he cuts Good goal, Keeping. Gardner searches long and Moore Moore finds himself just on the edge of the box cement a position and his serve clubs re really well didn't go so well for him at the Wanderers the sort of confidence that Ernie Merrick might have in him could be the difference for it this is Opa Desano well found by Gardner the Trumbus steers it away at the near post Yudakovic couldn't control it Gardner looking to launch it Just looking maybe for that ceiling goal. And there it might be. Quality of their goals. Particularly those from Gardner in the first half and Corley. Now Smith, who's been denied repeatedly, repeatedly by McCabe. And again, there's not too much room in the centre of the park. Oh, nice touch by Gardner. Quality touch by Gardner to Moore. 
into Smith. Nice touch by Smith. He hits it. And Wales saved by... Remington. Gardner finds himself with a little bit of space. i tell you what, if Remington and Sutton had their time again, you'd probably only get one of them jumping because you know the ball's going to bounce down and one can just wait for it. But they both jumped together, knocked each other out virtually and missed out an opportunity. Gardner out to the goal. Spurway. But he's a menace for the defenders. He's always in and about. He makes great runs.